26.17 million people live in Australia today. 10.7% of them, unfortunately, smoke. That's 2.8 million people. If it was a city or country, it would be the size of Chicago. Next year in Australia, 20,500 people are predicted to die of smoking. This must stop. What if policymakers can change that? In the UK, smoking rates have plummeted to just 14%. That's some great news. The solution? Vaping. Vaping is more than twice as effective as nicotine replacement therapies like nicotine gums or patches for quitting smoking. Professor David Levy developed a model to calculate how many tobacco-related deaths would be avoided by smokers switching to vaping. 1.29 million Australians will die from smoking between 2017 and 2080 if nothing changes. If smokers switch to vaping, 104,200 deaths would be avoided. 2.05 million life years would be gained. Policymakers in Australia have the chance to act now and save millions of lives through policies that recognise the potential of tobacco harm reduction and promote vaping as an alternative to smoking for those who cannot or will not quit and by ensuring their availability and affordability. Policymakers can use David Levy's model to calculate the life years gained if they put these policies in place to make sure the future looks like this. To learn more, visit tobaccoharmreduction.net.